some of the most valuable treasures in Tears of the Kingdom are armor sets, and one of the most useful armor sets that you can find fairly easily is the Glide Suit. Here's how you get it. Scattered around the skies of Hyrule are three Sky Islands, Courage Island, Valor Island, and Bravery Island. By completing a skydiving minigame at each one, you'll gain a piece of the Glide Suit. Getting to these islands is not a super simple matter though. The first one you'll find is likely Courage Island, as the Lindor's Brow Skyview Tower is one of the easiest and earliest towers you'll unlock. If you look up in the sky once you fast travel to this tower, you'll spot Courage Island. You probably know what to do from here. Hop into the tower, blast off, and then maneuver yourself to the top of the helixy looking island. There you'll activate a mini game that has you diving through the rings all the way to the bottom of the island. Once you finish, you'll talk to the construct, and then you'll have to do it again as an official ceremony. This time though, you'll be timed. Beat the required time, and you'll be rewarded with the glide shirt. Now you gotta do this two more times. The next island, Valor Island, is located far to the east, at the South La Nehru Sky Archipelago. To get there, you're gonna wanna fast travel to the South La Nehru Tower, launch yourself up, and then paraglide northwest. Take a pit stop on this floating island to pick up an airship, and then continue flying all the way towards this giant island off in the distance. Drop off once you get close, land in the pond, and you've made it. Same deal here. Talk to the construct to get teleported up to the top, do the course once, and then do it again with a time limit to this time get the glide mask. The final island, Bravery Island, is located right above the Lost Woods. But to get there, you'll want to fast travel to the Thyflo Ruined Skyview Tower. Fly south once you launch yourself skyward, and aim to land on this round floating island. Here you're going to launch yourself with the man cannon, and fly south as far as your stamina will take you until you reach the bottom of another helix looking island. Do one more pair of ring challenges, and congratulations! You'll win the glide tights, and are now the proud owner of a completed glide suit. Note that you can keep coming back to these challenges, and every time you beat your score, you will receive a large zonai charge which is a fantastic way to stockpile the very useful item. And that's our quick guide on how to get the glide suit in Tears of the Kingdom. For more quick tips like these, make sure to head over to IGN.com to check our growing Tears of the Kingdom wiki and interactive map. And for everything else Zelda, keep it here on IGN.